Hi everyone, hello. So today I have another MTs video. Now we all know that I have been collecting these products for almost two years now, and I have been sharing like all the products in parts, and I also add like new MTs into my collection. And first we used to store this in this bag. Now I have all my products in this bag, so that's really great because I've like filmed all the other stuff and got out of the junk. I've been actually collecting all these MTs for years now so some products that you might see I finished like long ago but I'm only sharing it now and some I have finished very recently so yeah if you are interested in knowing what those products are did I like them will I repurchase them then please keep on watching okay so first let me talk about this derma fake toner now uh, I got this toner when Shreya Jain recommended it I feel everybody got it when she recommended it but to be honest I have found like a much better toner that suits my skin tone i did not like this one as much not saying that this is bad in any means it is still a very good toner but uh, i don't think it's for me but i really feel this would be great for normal to oily skin people i also love the packaging on this one it is very pretty very chic looks extremely expensive but is not next it's very strange but i only have one body care product in today's video and it's this roll-on deodorant from yardley the variant that i have is london roll and uh, I, I don't know how I feel about this one and yeah it's matching my outfit today I actually love all the fragrances from Yardley and that is exactly why I got this but I did not end up enjoying this product or this roll-on deodorant as much I will stick to my Nivea roll-on deodorant which I recently got from the Nika pink Friday sale or I don't know hot pink sale and from now on I will stick to my Nivea roll-on deodorant because I have tried out so many other deodorants but I will still always go back to that one the next product I don't remember for the life of me if I've mentioned this in my previous empties video or not if I have I must have put it back into this bag so this is the simple uh, replenishing rich moisturizer and I really like how lightweight this moisturizer is really great for people who have sensitive skin and I think you like it even if you have oilier skin or dry skin or normal skin for that matter it's a very lightweight moisturizer will not feel heavy on your face will not make you feel greasy like this one for some but I don't think that it is great for me during winters because I personally have really dry skin now on to this product which I have loved from all my heart and I'm really sad that this is over this is the Claire's vitamin C serum I have like an entire review on this serum I will link it on the eye here or maybe after you finish watching this video you can check that video out and you guys can see it for yourself the difference that this product has made on my skin however I don't like the fact that this comes in a clear packaging and it compromises with the actual quality of the vitamin C but I still did see a very huge difference on my skin so I'm kind of on the fence if I will repurchase this or should I try another vitamin C serum I have been looking out for a vitamin C serum but I cannot decide if I should go for the plum vitamin C serum or the minimalist vitamin C serum if you guys have tried any of those out or if you would want a review from me on any of those products let me know in the comments down below and I will pick that one up. Next product is this face mask from Alps Goodness. Now this is a brand I think exclusive to purple and uh, I don't like this product. This is this was like a very chotu mask and it had the charcoal mask in it. I to be honest did not finish the entire thing also like I was so bored of using this came okay, and I thought uh, let it be I'm just throwing this away it dried down very quickly inside the packaging itself and I know that's not a big deal you can still pour in some water or any face mist and you can still use the face mask but I feel it really did not do anything for my skin also a product that I got from purple.com it's the good vibes argan oil the entire label is gone it was like an argan oil with those gold flakes did not like this at all did not use it on my face i ended up giving it to my mom and she used it on her body on or on her hands i don't know how she finished it up but then she finished it up somehow so no never repurchasing that ever again the next product and same goes here i did not like this mama earth cream at 
all okay i again have an entire review on this product and you'll see why i did not like this and why i would never recommend this to anybody okay? i ended up using this product as a foot cream so yeah you're meant to use this on your face and you pay like five or six hundred rupees and you don't get a lot of product in here and i ended up using it as a foot cream so that's how you know i will never in my life repurchase this product i have more products but i don't want this video to be too long so i'll only share three more with you so i want to talk about the biotic bio papaya visibly flawless skin face wash i really like this face wash this it comes with those tiny little beads in them so it acts like a really mild exfoliating face wash nothing too harsh on your skin to be honest i was not the only one who finished this up my grandma loves it a lot the last two products that i would like to share are the m caffeine um, coffee body scrub and also the m caffeine coffee face serum so these are the two things from m caffeine i got this one a very long time ago when i purchased the mask from m caffeine i really like that mask too and uh, yeah this was like a mini scrub thingy that they gave me to be honest i took a very long time to finish this product because i really like the smell of it and how luxurious it made me feel uh, for some reason in my head i was like i need to save this for special occasions only but it's not even that expensive so i don't even know why i was saving this but eventually i realized it was time to let it go and then mujhe isko fatafat se khatam karna pada because uh, i feel it kind of started going back will i be repurchasing it no i actually have like a silicone body scrub thingy which i have mentioned in one of my videos that i am really enjoying that i love using it as a scrub so yeah i feel i will stick to that for now the next product as i mentioned is this face serum from m caffeine itself i have a entire review on this particular serum i don't think i will repurchase this solely for the packaging i feel it's very inconvenient and i would rather try something new out not necessarily a bad product you can buy it if you feel like you want something like this in your skincare collection yeah that's it for today's video i still have a lot of products that i want to share with you but i will share it in my next video also look at my nails did you guys see this on instagram if you didn't you should really follow me on there i post a lot of stuff there and i'm really active on dms and stories so come say hi and if you enjoy today's video please give this video a thumbs up it really helps me out let me know in the comments down below which product have you emptied this month and also consider subscribing to this channel before you leave and i'll see you in my next one bye